us crazy, but things are finally right. With you and I, the future is bright. So today, I'm headed over to DMV to register my trailer. Never done it before. I didn't even know you could do that until the salesman at the tractor supply store mentioned it. I remember he said when he was hooking up the trailer to my SUV, he said, do you guys know that you have to register it? And I'm like, what? I said, I nodded yes, but I really didn't. So yeah, we're going over to Boston Spot. That's where our, our DMV office is located in Saratoga, Saratoga County. And we should be in and out, hopefully within 30 minutes. All right, guys, so we just left DMV and I got tags for my trailer. All right, so yeah, the uh, Saratoga uh, County DMV offices at the uh, Boston Spa, the people there were very polite, super fast and friendly. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not used to, I'm from South Jersey, Philadelphia area, and I'm not kind of, I'm not used to that, so. Yeah, I think it's kind of funny. All right, so anyway, normally I don't brag about expensive trips. However, I'm at the gas station. My car is very empty. How much will it be? I don't know, but I'm starting to get nervous. Oh, wow, it just hit 60. Jesus, I need to ask the Navy for a raise. 65 and counting what 6838 caramba ay bendito dios mio yeah i need a pay raise navy it's such a nice day that we decided to stop here at the park and just go for a little walk. The wife and I, she's right behind me. You see her? Yeah, I think the temperature went up to like 51, 52. It's a beautiful day. I need to recover from that uh, gas shock. It's late March and we still have little bit of snow on the ground I suspect it'll be there for another week or so all right so where am I gonna put this plate uh, I don't know well I think here I see these things on either side of this light where a possible license plate can go yep all right guys so this is our first two pieces of equipment that we are to carry on a trailer and we're headed up to my house All right, guys, so we made it back home, and here is the equipment. Now, why do I have a lawnmower? And what is, what do they call this, an edger? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and give it a tune-up, clean it up, and bring it back to my daughter. Yeah, these lawnmowers, they need a tune-up about once, every, once a year, and definitely overdue. So I think she's had it for about five or six years and a tune-up has never been done on it. So take a look at it. Uh, in, a, in a few days, I'm gonna go ahead and start and make it look like new again. At least that's the goal. I already have the spark plug, the oil, and the air filter. That should take just uh, about an hour or so. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and offload it, take it over to my shed.
all right so there it is i'm very happy with my trailer purchase first use today and i just wanted to point something out this ball here now i have a a two inch ball with a three quarter inch shank now this uh nut back here or down here if you have a a three quarter inch shank which is the threaded part of this ball then you torque it down to 150 pounds of torque if you have a one inch shank then that's torqued to 250 pounds but if you have an inch and a quarter shank then that you torque to 450 foot pounds of torque again this is a three quarter so i'm only going to tor torque it to 150. i just wanted to point that out in case you know you went out there and uh, got a, uh, a hitch um, and you installed the ball for the first time ever i, I just learned it um, I, I spoke to the uh, dealer and that's what they told me and generally those are the uh what these things are torqued to so i just wanted to point that out and yeah it's getting uh it's getting a little late and by the way guys today i replaced the last four led lights in my garage with these and i'm super happy it turned out better than expected the garage is uh evenly lit the nice and bright I can't wait to work inside the garage at night. So yeah, those LED lights specifically made for garages, perfect, beautiful. So what I'm gonna do now, because these are cardboard, I'm gonna burn them in my boiler. Obviously I could recycle them, but the boiler will do just fine. Ah, uh, let me tell you, what a beautiful day today. Uh, it's, uh, I think it's going to go up to 50 today. Uh, right now it feels like 46. Man, I want to work out here all day, but I'm not. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do some maintenance on my daughter's uh, uh, lawnmower. I bought the parts yesterday, and I'm ready to start here in about a few seconds. Even in the hot time. Weather and these storms 